Random Wiki Pages 2008 Georgia Imperial Sugar Refinery Explosion On February 7, 2008, a massive explosion ripped through the Imperial Sugar Refinery in Port Wentworth, Georgia. This wasn't just an industrial accident. It was a tragedy that claimed 14 lives and injured 36 others. And the most shocking part? It was entirely preventable. The workday was ending when a powerful blast shook the facility. The explosion originated in a basement beneath the sugar storage silos. This initial explosion was just the beginning. The culprit was sugar dust. Over time, massive amounts of fine sugar dust had accumulated throughout the facility. When this dust became airborne and found an ignition source, it created a volatile mixture. The first explosion sent more sugar dust into the air, triggering a devastating series of secondary explosions that tore through the plant. The scale of the disaster was immense. Firefighters and rescue teams from multiple counties rushed to the scene. The fire burned for days, and the search for the missing was a grim task. In the end, all six missing workers were found to have perished in the blast. Investigations by the Chemical Safety Board, OSHA, and the ATF all came to the same conclusion. This was a preventable disaster. Poor housekeeping and a lack of safety procedures led to the dangerous accumulation of sugar dust. The refinery's old construction also contributed to the severity of the fire. In the aftermath, Imperial Sugar was fined millions for safety violations. The damaged parts of the plant were demolished and rebuilt. A monument now stands at Legacy Park, honoring the victims of the explosion. The 2008 Imperial Sugar Refinery explosion serves as a stark reminder of the importance of industrial safety and the devastating consequences of neglecting it. Thanks for watching. If you found this video informative, please like and subscribe for more random wiki pages.